Right, so here's the setup. An old PC running Mac 3. And down here, the basic table at the moment. Uh, step motor here, step motor here, step motor here, running the Z. And for the second, I've been trying to calibrate with a Sharpie, but uh, I'm going to have to make something else. But I'm sure you want to see it run quickly. So we just drive it off the cursor keys. And this isn't uh, optimally sped up at the moment, but it's smooth. That seems to be about the best I can get out of the or oh, the uh, Z axis it's stalling out at the moment. I think I need to turn the uh, motor down a little bit. Yeah, you can see every now and again she's when there's a tight spot she's uh, yeah, stalling out. That's okay. That's just a matter of fiddling around with it. Um, yeah, seems pretty solid. Got a little bit of uh, slack there. I don't know if you can see a little bit of wobble, but uh, that's just a matter of uh, tweaking and so on. Tied all this cable up. Um, need to get some energy chains for that, but uh, apart from that, we're all looking good. So, yeah, onwards and upwards. The final plan is to get that bad boy connected up. Meant to add, here's our uh, control board. Sorry, it's uh, crap lighting in the garage. These are our motor drivers for the steppers. It's our breakout board, which basically stops the PC from blowing up. A uh, 5 volt power supply to run the breakout board. And then uh, this is just a 24 volt power supply there, which runs all the motors. So the steppers are running 24 volt. Um, and then a good old fashioned parallel port up to the old junker PC. So, yeah. The issue we have is, unfortunately, cable ties only hold this well in the X direction. The Y direction immediately makes it fall over, so I'm having trouble drawing lines. So the joy of technology, we can try and make this. I'm very lucky in having access to my uh, works CAD modeling system, so something like this can be knocked up very quickly. So the bolt hole patterns go there. Sharpie obviously goes in there, little marker to indicate direction, that's pointing down. And then we can slip two cable ties through there to hopefully secure that in place. We shall see. But then the magic happens. Excuse the fans, the uh, printer's not the best. Which needs a lot of cooling not to cock up. We're nearly there now. And there we go. Finished product. Looks like it's come out fairly well. Truth. Proof is in the pudding. Oh, yeah. Oh. So I'm asleep. Some cable ties. Fold that in. So I'll give that a go tomorrow, but it's bedtime now because I am tired. Good night, everyone.